sorry for the interruptions <coughs> now <coughs> so <coughs> this fixture could be used in in a uh, finished basement with insulation or without insulation because there are rules that if you use a a halogen light you cannot use it in a basement with insulated ceilings you must have a special barrier around your fixture if you have an insulated ceiling because the halogen lights are very hot you cannot touch them with your hand and they might uh, burn the insulation and create a fire now if you are using the LED LED fixtures with LED bulbs you can use them in insulated ceilings because they are warm to the feeling and they will not burn any insulation okay so now so here you can have a direction different direction to the beam or no direction so as I said this is the halogen bulb this you can give it a gift to somebody or or sell them or throw them it's up to you we don't need this what we will use is so as I said we need a G10 connector GU sorry GU10 connector see this is the GU10 so this connector should match this connector So what information we can read here the brand name the 3000 K that's the color and 475 lumen 120 volt this is the voltage 60 Hertz and they are dimmable now this is very important if you want to use a dimmer because if you want to use a dimmer and they are not dimmable they will not work and of course China it's okay as long as it's uh, FCC approved and it's uh, UL US listed so this is the UL lab that tests all the electrical equipment in Canada and US and they guarantee us that this bulb will not kill you, will not explode, will not make a fire. So this UL labs, their job to test everything electri electronic or electrical coming to Canada and US from outside and the color is white so it will fit in here with a small effort see like that see look nice Я записываю. Что тебе сказал, Свет? Окей. 
Okay. Now, when you install these fixtures, what you need to do, you need to make a hole. Okay, so it's four inch hole. You can use a special tool for that or just a knife. Then You have your extra wire here you wire this okay then after wiring you insert these fixtures inside like that then they it will look like this picture here okay now the distance between these two it's up to you it depends on your ceiling on your room what you want to do with the room but I like very bright room because I have a dimmer so if I want the light down I will dim it down so it's so easy now about the price of of this little little light little bulb in the stores the price will be maybe 10 bucks maybe 12 bucks this one I bought for nine something so let's say 10 which is expensive but in uh, Canada we have a program by the government it's called energy saving program so how it works you print a coupon at home from the website looks like that see save five dollars on LED bulbs so this is valid till 31st December 2018 so when you print this coupon and you come to your hardware store right away you will receive five dollar discount on list price so this bulb ended costing me around five dollar five dollar plus the fixture depends which one you buy maybe eight nine dollar fixture ten dollar fixture so this was about ten dollar so the whole thing is fifteen dollar per one pot light and uh, <clears throat> if you do it yourself it's uh, it's pretty good price now if you look at this little little uh, little box here the silver box this is actually a thermal protection so if the temperature inside the fixture will rise this box will disconnect the power to the light so if you see your lights are flickering going on and off on and off 
means uh, the picture is becoming too hot inside so you have to maybe replace the bulbs or take care of the ventilation of that fixture well basically that's all <clears throat> so I did my basement it's not finished because we are painting so basically I can I can touch the connector without any problem see it's not hot so that will go like that inside it's not hot but the amount of light it gives you is equivalent to the original 50 watt halogen light with less power consumption and less heat generated so it's a win-win situation plus plus the coupons maybe in the state in US you have a similar program for energy saving devices now one thing about these coupons these coupons are supposed to be available freely in the hardware stores but what they do they hide them or they say they don't have them to force you to buy at a full price which is not acceptable that's why I make this video thank you for watching